Hey guys, welcome back to the Simi Plum Bob channel, and today we're going to do a speed uh, create a sim and a speed build for a brand new thing that's coming to the channel after tomorrow or tomorrow. Um, what are these days this week, okay? So, as you all know, there's a new update coming out uh, for Tuesday, or if those of you that don't know, there's an update that's going to be coming out on Tuesday that's going to involve terrain manipulation, a, a, a style influencer career, and a brand new feature that we've never ever seen in The Sims before. And that feature, my dears, is actually the feature of playing in first person. And this is what this Let's Play is going to be all about. It's playing The Sims throughout a Sims life in first person. So, what we see here in front of us is we're actually building my person's family. So I've decided to play this person from um, toddlerhood all the way up to the ripe old age of elder status when they die. So we're going to play the, um, this character's name um, all the way through her life. Um, it's going to be a short life because that's the lifespan I put it on. And yeah, so who knows how far this Let's Play is actually going to go. But I have an idea and let me tell you about the background of this story. So the story is set back a little bit before the time of now. Um, the values is that women don't get jobs. Men work for their women. They actually go. Um, they get married. Uh, their uh, parents choose their spouse for them. It's around that time frame. And maybe has, well, hold on a minute. Maybe it's more modern and not in that time frame. But this family, the World C family, actually, <laughs> actually values those old traditions and keeps it going. And there are actually some other families that actually love to keep it going as well. So. I'm lucky for the sim that I'm actually playing, the da their daughter, which is Belvedere and Sheridan's daughter. Um, they've already picked out a husband for her, and she can't go to work, um, but she can still go to school because it's mandatory in modern day. But they keep all their old traditions, and she's already got a... She's pretty much already betrothed to someone even if she's never met that person you know so this is the type of family that she's growing up in but little do they know their daughter is not going to follow up in those traditions she's going to want to go off and do her own little thing and um she wants to actually get a career and be um more than just a housewife uh, no offense mom but uh <laughs> My sim actually does have an older brother, and uh, he follows the rules to the T. So, um, Mato really values his parents' traditions, and he doesn't see anything wrong with it because, hey, he's the boy, and he gets to go off and go into any job he wants. He gets to marry the woman of his dreams if he really wanted to, so why would he have a complaint in the world? But uh, the character that we're going to be playing as, her name is Bria, and she's going to actually try to fight <laughs> the traditions that her parents have been going on uh, along with for generations, so... She's going to be probably in their eyes the troublemaker, but to me, this is actually what we need. she needed to do for this family. She doesn't want to continue on this freaking tradition, um, generation after generation, and she wants to stop this. She wants to be like, the women of this family can go get jobs as much as men can, you know, so she wants to start fighting for her right to do what she wants or pleases when she ages up to an adult. And she says, I don't care if I, you've already got me patrolled to someone. I am not going to marry that person. And that is going to cause a lot, a lot of problems in the, this family. Uh, because they, they feel very 
close ties to their tradition and they don't want to break it and their daughter is going to give them hell she is not gonna go for that she's like I want to be able to have a career dad look in the times you gotta stop living in these outdated traditions and start you know up updating the times women get to have jobs just as much as men do dad and it's unfair that um, Mato gets to go and have a job of his own while I have to sit at home and bear children. I, what if I don't want to get married? What if I don't want children, Dad? I want to be able to have a career. A career that will make me feel fulfilled. So, yeah. Uh, so, we're, this is going to be pretty interesting playing through that story in first person. But that's the general idea of the story. And, yeah. I really wanted to share that with y'all. And also, I wanted to share... <laughs> you know this family and so that this is the only time you actually get a really good um, uh, far view look of everything because once we get back to this house it's going to be in first person you guys it's definitely going to be in first person so yeah I really 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 wanted to share the, this family and yeah I hope you are hyped about it because I certainly am so yes this will not come out until after you know the update has been released for the public and so that means it will not come out today <laughs> so I made this video actually for today um, or if anybody's confused with me saying today as in I made this video um, for you know the day of the update and so yeah so instead of actually starting, we're actually going to start this um, after today. <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay, so uh, this house really had no agenda to it. I just really wanted to build a nice little house for them to live in. And I chose uh, Brindleton Bay mostly because it's in the countryside. And I feel that maybe these traditions they they live in the country still they into technology or like brand new technology such as you know social media and things like that they're still in the boondocks areas so you know they they really don't get into the uh the commercials or medias and um what people watch on TV they just don't really get into that they are more or less you know just they just have technology either to get their skills up or for um, her husband's career or Sheridan's husband's career is what I meant to say <laughs> but yeah um, this is just a quaint little home small bedrooms it's nothing too extravagant and so yeah when I was building this uh, the inspiration in me was was like dwindling you know I <laughs> I could not really actually get so inspired to actually go and um, decorate to the my fullest potential and I'm afraid that if I left it and went back to building it I wouldn't have the new let's play up for you guys to see and plus i don't when the update comes up i really don't want to be decorating the house you know i really want to be playing that update you know but when we get back i'll probably add some more terrain tool or terrain manipulation outside um just to make it look like it came from the update and um they finish it off that way and yeah, yeah i'm so excited <laughs> okay but um yeah uh so with that being said i think i'm going to stop me talking here and excuse me thank you all so much for watching and i really hope you like this create a sim or create a family slash uh speed build i made here 
and I hope you enjoy the rest of the speed build and uh, I will see you on the first episode of first person let's play I don't know what I'm calling it yet but that's what it's gonna be called at the moment <laughs> everybody have a great day